Hey everybody, how are you today? So we're here for April's design team challenge announcement um, for my design team, but also for all of you in a little share. So normally I'm playing with my products when I do the announcement or making backgrounds or whatever journaling. This month I really wanted to share in one place all the different inches that everybody made inches that everybody made um, last month for March. So I'm filming this um, in the last um, part of March and I am waiting on one more shipment from somebody um, to um, send all of these um, out to everybody. I don't have her inches yet. So there is one, Wendy, who isn't here yet. Um, but everybody's done a great job uh, making inchies. I'm going to link all of their videos, including Wendy's, in the description below. Now, for my part, I'm collecting all the inchies. I'm dividing them up amongst everybody and sending that, them out. I really wanted to send them all a thank you. So I made a bunch of these. You're like, I'm sure you're like, what is that? <laughs> I'm gonna show you. So these are little package present wrapped little bundles. There is an inchy inside of here. It's wrapped in one of the prints from my digital downloads from my Etsy shop. There is another um, deli paper or vintage typing paper image inside of that, which is either stamped or a graphite rubbing from one of the rubber stamps, if you remember way back when, when I did those. Um, and if you don't and you'd like to see a video on that, it's like super simple, but I can I can do a video on that. You all let me know in the comments. Um, anyway, I, I put the inchy inside with the little vellum or vintage typing paper image in there, wrapped it in the digital print and sealed it with washi tape. I did 12 of these little inchies and if you follow me on Instagram, you already know what they look like. So they were little miniature one inch landscapes, watercolor landscapes, Pacific Northwest inspired and using a new palette I put together of Pacific Northwest colors. And it, aren't they cool? I of course did save one for myself. I'm sending one to each design team member. And here's the fun part with this month's design team announcement. It's also a giveaway. I have four extras. So I'm going to put a, a link to the giveaway in the description below. And we'll use PicMonkey. Uh, PicMonkey? No. <laughs> I have that random number place that I, that I use. Um, um, a random giveaway. I don't know. I'll figure it out. Anyway, there'll be a link for the giveaway in the description below. Click it and enter. Um, and four of you lucky people will get these, uh, one of these inchies. Um, they're all of a similar image, but no two of them are exactly alike. And what they're wrapped in, each one is different. So I am excited to give those away um, this month. And the challenge for April for all of those of you who are interested in following along with what the design team is doing is I'm challenging them with the words cut and punch. So how can you use my products from my Etsy store with those two words, cutting them out and using them as embellishments, using them with a punch. You can, of course, one of the things I've, you know, I've been wanting to do and I haven't done yet. We'll talk about it now. I'm hoping I actually do a video on it this month, is uh, make artist trading coins. I do have a digital download for some images for the front of the coins, and I have a digital download for the backs. So I am hoping to actually get to that this month and that we do um, some artist trading coins. So look for that video later this, this month. That is just one really quick idea. Um, and some of these are not images that were made for the coins. Like this is just a printout, of a test print I did for some labels. But I thought it would be a cute background for the coins. So um, what else can you do? You can of course stamp the images and individually cut them out and use them as embellishments. But what unique, interesting things can you guys come up with? I sure would be interested to see. So that's it for April. 
Um, I can't wait to see what everybody comes up with. Check the design team blog page for their video links every week. I try to do it on Monday. Life does happen and I forget to do it sometimes on Monday, but I try to do it every Monday to update the page, add all of the live video links to the page and um, the graphic images and everything like that. There's always a featured artist at the top. So I try to update that every Monday um, by about 8 a.m., 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. So uh, I hope that you check that out. I'll put the link for the design team blog in the description below. Go show them some love. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe here and on their channel. And above all, go out and have a great day. Play with your stuff. Come up with something interesting and do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. And I'll see you later. Bye, guys.